once again updating this is from a, a few days ago I'm not sure if these lean tools were there last time um, we did take notice of this structure here the rock there we kind of structure kind of extends out this way which I call the porch and the, there's an entrance here just got a branch there and the theme seems to be you guys check out Angelus Sasquatch I love his uh, attention to detail we found several pieces of like rubber and some of the structure did fall apart here I don't know if maybe it's due to wind or what uh, we got a rubber black tire and in a couple other the structures we found black uh, pieces of either plastic or rubber and look at this out here these two are kind of crossing I'm not gonna say it's an X but that's a wishbone under there we got that on top of course we got our other one here this is a nice one Boom. which is a signature for me and there's certain certain other little things that happen that you know we find in structures and around the areas that lead me to believe it's not people and earlier today I spoke to a gentleman and he gave me his thoughts and his opinions and I respected and loved it that you know he was uh, open and, and I had mentioned that, yeah, you know, I think it's people, da, 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 just to kind of keep the conversation going. But you know what I think, you guys? I think this is fully Sasquatch activity, Bigfoots. And man, there's, I might have mentioned, there's uh, many encounters, activity in this area. You can find it in books, you can find it online. Out there fishing, and so these are areas that are are not known for activity. These are hot spots, you guys and gals. So you know, I feel like we are not wasting time here. Maybe in a certain way, but <laughs> let's head up that that hill up there. I just missed everything I came for, but I got led to this. <laughs> Obviously, I walked too far and I stopped here. Check that out. All right, let's head back. It's getting dark, and uh, I think I'll follow that and we'll go that way few other structures that I found today that I want to document before it gets too dark and they rearrange or they disappear. Is that quartz? You all remember the structure where uh, I had a bunch of crows and it was a big, uh, what do you call it? I call them beams, but um, Kev is squatching, calls them. Uh, he has a word for them, it might come to me. But anyway, there's a bunch of crows flying around and they were building uh, the lean-tos on the beam that's completely gone and they had used the pallet as well which is a very unique feature in some of these structures people have been finding pallets in 
in the woods and different areas incorporated with uh, the structures anyway I'm back up here today so there's been movement there too bad it it's gone because it was a nice it was a nice one I thought they were gonna build a huge uh, structure there this big piece of wood looks almost like stone it's amazing uh, but I think they started doing the same thing back here so check this out this is where the water runs through so it's it is wet down there I did check for prints I actually just fell down here but check this out we got our beam there and if I'm not mistaken it looks like one two three four for, I mean you could count them several branches have been placed there and so I'm thinking they're gonna complete the other side and build up so structure in progress in my opinion and uh, yeah movement back here and not too many people hang out back here usually everyone's down at the water so is interesting as always once again the small stuff notice that there that's leaned on top that one's crossing now that I'm looking at it it's almost like an A we got our seaweed wrapped around on the other side we also have a piece of driftwood that's leaned on that which is uh, pretty bizarre could be the ocean not sure but this is very interesting to me even that piece of driftwood in between those two pieces or one piece of seaweed pretty bizarre Here's another set of leans. And pretty typical, unique, but typical of a lot of the structures that we find. Why would anyone do this? I'm not sure. I mean, I come out here and I don't get the urge to start collecting and placing sticks or rocks. <laughs> some people might. I know some people build sand castles and different things, but could very well be a human. Not sure, but... Uh, yeah, I think it's worthy of uh, documenting. Let's see what's going on further down the beach here. This, I believe, was a structure that was taken down that we've uh, seen several times. I just wanted to show you right quick piece of rope once again a reoccurring theme knots and ties with uh, different materials and uh, sometimes they serve no purpose I really think that uh, it's just kind of bizarre
I was passing by this and I thought to myself, is that a leaner on the porta potty? Lean the stick there, probably a walking stick most likely, but <laughs> I just thought I'd uh, record that. Here's a change in scenery. Always all types of microclimates in the county. Go up a hill. It could be completely different from down the hill or further north and down south. I was just asking for a sign. I'm way up from the beach. I found these resting on a log. Small scale structure. We're on private property here. And I've been waiting for a structure made out of madrone. And there's a nice X down there. A road goes by, but uh, there's a piece of property right next to that. And I don't know those people. So I'm not going to go down there with a camera, but hopefully uh, soon if I get to talk to someone maybe get permission I could go take a better footage of it but I'll take this for now